past several months, since 10th March, long-range free balloons released in Japan carried explosives to the North American continent. Easterly winds that prevail at 20 to 30,000 feet swept the balloons across the Pacific in from 85 to 135 hours. Aleutian-based fighters intercepted a number of the balloons and made photographic passes before shooting them down. About 33 feet in diameter, the balloons were filled with 19,000 cubic feet of hydrogen gas. Ballast dropping mechanism and bomb loads were hung about 45 feet below the bag. When hit with incendiaries, the balloons burned but did not explode. A detonating charge and flash bomb were supposed to destroy the apparatus and gas bag when the balloon's mission was completed. But a number of them were found intact. The spherical bag was made of five-ply rice paper, which was shellacked for weatherproofing. Construction indicated the balloons were being mass-produced at little cost. An escape valve automatically released gas if the balloon rose too high. Anti-personnel and incendiary bombs and the control mechanism were mounted on a circular aluminum frame. Ballast was automatically released when the balloon dropped below a set altitude, estimated at 20,000 feet. A wet cell battery was carried to supply power for operation of control apparatus. Ballast weights were held by simple hooks. A series of barometric aneroid switches governed height. It is believed the main purpose of the bombs was to start brush and forest fires, but attacks were so scattered and aimless that they constituted no military threat. <laughs> 